I think, yes. There was a clap. That should get sync, everyone. I think. Who wants to do an intro? Me or Chad? Uh, why doesn't Dave do it? All right. Or Keith. Okay. Are you ready for an intro? Yeah. All right. Welcome uh, to... Cal, you... Hey. No, don't. Yeah. You should be a fucking ashamed. Look at that shame face. Look at... I'll do a Vanna White smile. Putting it right there. Do a Vanna White beat. <laughs> All right. Five, four, three, two. All right. Welcome to Big Geeky Couch. Tonight we're going to be reviewing Plastic, which is a comic book. Yeah, don't. By Doug Wagner and Daniel Hilliard. Oh, I'm supposed to add more? Yeah, you're supposed to introduce us, but never mind. You didn't. Oh yeah, there's these people. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> Plastic is a comic book. <laughs> what? What? I'm doing a great job. I'm doing a great <laughs> intro here. Why are you laughing at me? Why are you ruining my intro? God, this is the first time you want to be doing it, and you're ruining it. Hey, director, should we get a take two? We broke. No, this is, this is He's fine. It's broken. It's, uh, it's, it's good. good. It's good. Oh, we're destroying Just take it down a little. <laughs> okay. All right, go on. D Dave, are you okay? Yeah, I, like I said, it's a comic. It's plastic. Um, so what did you think? Let's do it. <laughs> We were, gonna, we were going to talk. It's Chad. Yeah. yeah. What do you What do you think, Chad? Well, I was going to say exactly what it's about, but Kit, why don't you do it? Plastic <laughs> is about a man named. Well, he. You think he's got one name, but then another. But he is a serial killer, gone somewhat good. He's gone somewhat good, and he kills things with bags and, and plastic. Well, he doesn't really do that a lot. He kills most people with just like blunt force trauma. But all of it is like plastic things. Also a hexa. Uh, that was metal. Yeah. Also his. It's, it's more of his fist. It's yes. more of his quirk, to be honest, because he did use saw. Yeah. <laughs> he did use a saw and it wasn't plastic. He yeah, saw that, was, that was very not plastic. Uh, but his the whole deal is that he's kind he's very unhinged and he's fallen in love with and become going straight because of the love of a blow up doll. Yeah. But he gets involved in a crime circle and they steal it from him and make him do their dirty work in order to win his true love, Virginia the Blow-Up Doll, back. They hold it hostage. They, <laughs> yes, this is a story about a, a crime syndicate holding a blow-up doll hostage so they can get a serial killer to murder people. By the, by the way, this is, I just want to let you know, true story, this is the pilot for the next Taken. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, guys, what did you think of Plastic? I really liked it, actually. Really? Yeah. Um, The thing is, it starts out really kind of weird where it's just this guy that's banging a blow-up doll in a car, that and you think, oh, what a weirdo. Yeah. But then they make you really almost fall in love with him and his weird relationship by the end. And it's like you realize, you know what, even though that's weird, this was saving a lot of lives. A lot, <laughs> a lot of people were not being murdered because this serial killer found a way to put himself at peace. And then some people took that away from him, and we get to watch the fun. Yeah, it, uh, um... I actually went to this comic kind of thinking I wouldn't like it because it sounded very gimmicky. It's like, oh, he's got a blow, like a lot of things, like, oh, he loves a blow up down and he's in a plastic. But uh, it's five issues long. The writing's very tight. The comic yes. does the comic does not waste a single panel or page, yeah. which is nice. Everything, even weird little things and themes recur throughout it. Donuts is a recurring theme for whatever reason. Um, His mother is a weird reason. That's a weird one. Um, and then you find that he's got yeah, a bit yeah, of yeah. a oh, base thing going on with yeah. that. Yeah. Uh, those are like nice little breadcrumbs they give you to keep you curious. It is. It's like, is he actually? Are the one that I really like is like the super. Is there's kind of like a weird supernatural aspect of it. Mm -hmm. Is is the blow up doll actually alive? Because no. one of my favorite. Hang on a minute. One of my favorite concepts of it is one of the lines in this book is how hot this blow up doll is from one of the murder from one of the crime syndicate people. Oh yeah. He's like, this blow up doll is really hot. I'm gonna have a go at her. So it's like everybody is just acknowledging oh, yeah. that's blow up. They could have just been making fun no, of them. No, they were they were messing with them. See, I didn't. I didn't feel like that. I really no. didn't. I just felt like everybody was Chad just accepting. Went to no, Chad I really felt Virginia. like this. Is, yeah, yeah, hundred percent, absolutely. <laughs> ten ten taken out. Ten ten would do it. Again. <laughs> but uh, I just, I really felt like everybody was just like. This guy is really gonna talk to his blow-up doll. Well, fuck it. We're gonna talk to this blow-up doll, too. Like, it's a normal person. But at the same time, though, it was like, he was so convincing. I was like, is the blow-up doll really alive? Is it really talking back to him? I guess I was just being really is weird it, about it. Is but... it possessed by the spirit of, a, of somebody? Uh, yeah, I mean, there was, there was, 
Am I weird for thinking that? Yes. Yeah, oh, okay. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm screwing you all. Yeah. I'm um, sorry. The artwork is, is good. It's a, I would say the artwork's above average. It's very much in the school it's of... It's very of, basic. ...of a Ryan Howard, a uh, Jace... A uh, uh, Ryan Otley, sorry. It's like Ryan Otley. Not as good as Ryan Otley, I'd say. Um... Or like a tra or like a less developed trad more, I'd say. But there was never a panel where I was confused. I always knew what was happening. Characters were nicely expressive, and I did like. I think my favorite thing about the the series was actually the main character, the serial killer uh, Edwin's weird obsession with uh, being polite. Yeah. I think that kind of. I think that's one thing that helped sell his character was he had this odd thing about he was he has unfathomable amounts of rage and strength. That he will take out on people that anger him, but otherwise he's very polite, and yes. it's like it's to like a comical degree. Well, it's not just on people that anger him. Part part of the appeal of this book for me was discovering his ethic as you go, because right. there are points where he will do hideous, unspeakable things to you, but sometimes people will do nasty, mean things to him, and he'll just let it slide. So it's all about like as you go, you understand. Oh, his little like, he's got rules. Yeah, his yeah. weird rules, and that was fun to kind of figure out the contours. He's got his that. rules, his yeah. tells, his. His, his like uh, calling cards, yeah. all the all the classic serial killer things that you do. Lots of and heads he, in plastic bags. And I mean, to be honest, he's brilliant too. Yes. I mean, yeah. His like his psychosis basically makes it so that he's talking to these dead people, but figuring out how things, how basically doing all of his work for him. But it was incredibly convincing for me when when he, she was like, "And this is Virginia," and it was like. <laughs> Good, good, good thing. Have you, have you had a conversation with anybody who's like really dead? No. No, no, no. Like skits or out dead. there inside. I have conversations with Dave frequently. I, I'm, I'm just saying because from what, what he, what our character with Edwin was demonstrating is what I've dealt with with people like that, where they are funny. They are convinced. They are convinced right. of what this person is or that this person exists. Yeah. And to be perfectly honest with you, because of sometimes, depending on how the situation is, the atmosphere, you just gotta basically go, yeah. I'm not, gonna, like I'm, not gonna, gonna, I'm not gonna call you out on it. Yeah, not a lot to gain. Yeah. 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 Not sure what's gonna happen. One thing is, <laughs> plastic, plastic is probably one of my favorite books of last year. Oh, like, okay. Hands down. Or the year before, last uh, year. Let's see, publication date. Was it last year? Gauge, Image Comics. Uh, I read it. Jeez, I don't remember. I actually April 2017, year. last year. Yeah, yeah, last year. It was one of my favorite books. Not my top five, unfortunately. Mm. But at the same time, though, I absolutely enjoy plastic. It's fun. It's hilarious. It's incredibly convincing on a lot of levels. Because I, I'm sorry. At, throughout the book, I thought Virginia was a legitimate person. Well, he the way like the him. Was, he yeah, does. Yeah, like, he yeah. really does. And then I just, I really like the fact that that crime guy was just when he, when Edwin was gone, he was just like that blow up doll is really hot. I and also, then, <laughs> what you said about convincing, I think that's accurate too. Because there yeah. was bits in this where there's a, they throw a little. I mean, it's not like totally, totally realistic, but they throw little bits in like. When there was a crowd of like hitmen that were machine gunning the building where like the uh, our main character was in, you know, the typical thing I was like, oh yeah, they're all machine gunning the building and they're all gonna miss because it's you know a story, whatever. But no, then around like hits him right in the gut and then he'd yeah, and I'm like, that would actually happen and it yeah. happened in this and then you know then you're a little more invested to see where it goes from there because you the believability reestablishes itself exactly like yeah he when we first see him he immediately like kicks someone's knee out like casually it's like yeah. wow that's an ungodly amount of strength for this mr rogers looking dude <laughs> no if you get it at the right angle it's it was just like he came right out was like boom like wow also like headbutting someone else it was like what like you know like he's very like, efficient damn. at murdering people mm -hmm. and that's and it, like but at the same time it's rendered clearly so you always understand what's happening which is right. nice where it's not like oh he's right. suddenly like kick flipping someone's head off like, <laughs> yeah, it's not like batman like, begins where it's like camera shaky one, you know <laughs> oh, right and then yeah. you don't even know what's going on yeah. so. bats Bats. 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 Yeah. Bats. Bats. Bats are all over so, the place. I actually kind of want them to continue plastic. Um, I know they. <laughs> I'm about to say how. Hang on a minute. I want them to continue plastic with how it ended. They could actually. Okay, they could. There's like, a there's way. an entire way that they could follow up plastic. You're gonna have to walk me through this, cause what uh, I will. But spoiler, I'll speak... spoiler alert. Nope. I won't. I won't go through it, and we're not gonna talk. About <laughs> it. Okay, build up. But I'll speak this to you about This is a behind-the-scenes conversation that's going to so happen. So yeah, in the yeah. comments, everyone who has read the story to the end, you leave a comment on how plausible you think it is to continue the adventures with our hero. <laughs> I didn't say the adventures with our hero. 
But <laughs> I what could that mean? <laughs> I really, really like plastic. It was I good. I think it's yeah. a wonderful yeah. comic. I, I do have a complaint. Um, mm. I thought one of the villains was a little unrealistically bad. Maybe not unrealistic, but he was so juiced up to the nth degree that it was yeah, like that guy was... it's like like Rapey McDeputy. Oh my god! Oh my god. god. Yeah, yeah. My... I'm the sheriff. Hang Time on, to I'm rape. Gonna show this. I'm gonna... Get out, oh find that, god. find that scene. It's like yeah. literally, oh my god. he finds out he's the sheriff and immediately goes on like a raping. Spree. Literally <laughs> every female he sees in the entire book, he's like, I'm gonna rape you right now, even the blow up doll. And it's like, <laughs> right, you know, exactly. you, you can tell me that he's a bad guy. Without making it so far out there, there's just like geez, he, I mean, for, I don't think he's, he's not in the first issue. Don't okay. worry. Even rapists issue. are not <laughs> this enthusiastic <laughs> about rape, like all the time. Maybe well, rape. he'd only just became sheriff. Maybe he'd been like waiting for this. Like he was. It's a possibility. Good Lord. And he <laughs> never he never got to do any raping. <laughs> what guy thinks as soon as I'm sheriff, then I can rape as much as I want? That I mean, guy. We're not talking about guys. Just let you know we're not condoning <laughs> rape. Rape is bad. I am. Wait, saying. wait, what? 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 Guys, this was plastic. <laughs> <laughs> Let us know in the comments below. It seems like we all really enjoyed it. I thought it was, was it as good as Black Sad? No. No. Yes. <laughs> no. 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 It was this good. was a lot of fun. I think it's a fun book. It's not my favorite by any means. I think it's a little derivative of works like Giant the Homicidal Mania. Sure, yeah. And it's very much in the vein of a Mark Millar comic where it's like, how can I jam as much crazy shit? Like, whoa. But it, um, I feel like, especially in college, I would have loved this book. Yeah. Um, it's still good. It's, like I said, it's solid and I can't find any, like, huge faults with it. Just not my favorite. Right. Sorry, good, good clean layouts. I like it. Indeed, I agree. So guys, again, this was plastic. No, this was oh. the geeky couch. But I have one question for you. Paper or plastic, peeps? Remember that. Are we really gonna end on that note? Yes, you should have saved that until after I did the closing. <laughs> yeah, no, like, no, no, that's the closing. That's the closing. Because you know what? Do all the YouTube stuff.